I have an idea here for a really interesting computer programming project if somebody wants to take it on. And it has to do with big tech and how big tech have harvested our data. And we're never going to get that back because the cat's out of the bag. So there's like a voodoo doll version of each of us out there containing all these data points that's designed to throw targeted advertising in our face or even more nefariously to, to try and sway an election. So big tech has done this. They've invaded our privacy for years. Every Google search we've ever done has been logged. Every product we've ever looked for on Amazon, eBay, etc., that's all been logged. Every image we've ever hovered over a little longer than others, that has been logged. Yep, it's all been done. And it's all meaningful because our actions are meaningful, so it can all be used by big tech. So it occurred to me that there's no way to put the genie back in the bottle, but I could corrupt my data. I could go to Google right now and search for something that I'll never use, like cat food or lingerie, <laughs> something like that, right? Uh, but that's only one search. It's not really going to affect the overall profile unless I spend hours and hours every day searching for all kinds of random things. Haven't got time to do that, right? And that's where a skilled computer programmer would come in. Now surely I can't be the only person to think about this, but just in case I am, I'm going to make this video and I'm going to post it. Surely somebody could write a script that would use a little bit of your computer's bandwidth, a little bit of your processing power, and you just run it in the background every time your computer's on. And what it does is, it just sits there quietly in the background making random Google searches and random product searches on Amazon and, and stuff like that. It has its own, it would have to have its own dictionary of hundreds of thousands of possible search terms built into it. And it would just select these randomly and search for them on your behalf. Now you run that continually every time you're on your, every time you've got your phone with you and turned on, or every time you've got your computer switched on, you just have that script running all the time. Well, before long, that voodoo doll version of you that's out there is going to be just full of completely meaningless information. And it can no longer be used to target you in any way because it doesn't represent your actual interests. You see? Somebody, no doubt, could, pro could program this. And if it could get popular, if enough people would actually use it, this whole empire of privacy invasion would be brought to a halt, wouldn't it? Because if it's not meaningful anymore, Facebook, etc., can't make money off it anymore. It's all going to fall apart, you know? Something to think about. Maybe somebody out there with the right set of skills could take this idea of mine and actually run with it. Here's hoping.